the new frame is back from welding so I'm just gonna clean it up a bit and then it's ready uh, to mount the bike back together again everything has been fixed of the cracks the whole frame has been checked for cracks so all the points around the whole frame on the underside and the upside has been checked there are no more cracks in the frame everything is uh, as it should be so I'm just gonna continue now with this frame and um, start to put uh, put some um, parts back on it so the first thing I'm going to start with is just to polish off some some small marks so it's uh, done and then I'm going to start with the drilling hole I, I fixed this was broken so I'm gonna drill a hole here and mount the, the side stand on it I just had a friend to help me to, to lift everything here uh, back on place on the bike. So now I have the new frame. Now I'm just gonna tighten everything up. Put in uh, the radiator uh, frame and everything inside here to check if, uh, if uh, things line up as they should. And then if everything looks good, then I'm all set to go just to continue with the uh, with um, putting the bike together and also today I got uh, mail so here you can see I got some new stickers for the fairings, new decals decals all the small ones this is the big ones because I messed up one of the stickers a nice little souvenir on the garage door here you can see I've started to mount the bike back together the frame and everything is looking good you can see you have a gap between the front wheel and um, and the plastic here so that's an improvement from last time so what I'm going to do today I'm gonna put all the fairings on the bike uh, just to test mount it um, that everything is, is fitting correctly uh, and then I actually um, I got an email today that my engine parts uh, in uh, UK is uh, ready so I think uh, during the next week or so I will get all this all the parts for this engine back so I need to get going this um, I need to get going this uh, uh, fairings and, and to get all that uh, done and then I can start on the engine. 